Diatomic carbon, also called dicarbon, is an inorganic chemical with the chemical formula C equals C. It is a gas that only exists above 3,642 degrees Celsius below which it aggregates into graphite or fullerenes. It occurs in carbon vapor, for example in electric arcs, in comets, stellar atmospheres and the interstellar medium, and in blue hydrocarbon flames. Nomenclature Dicarbon is the preferred IUPAC name. The systematic names Ethody Leidner and Dicarbon, valid IUPAC names, are constructed according to the substitutive and additive nomenclatures, respectively. Ethody Leidner is viewed as ethylene with four hydrogen atoms removed. By default, this name pays no regard to the electronic state of the diatomic carbon. When the electronic state is considered, the states with no unpaired electrons are named ethodylidina, whereas the states with two unpaired electrons are named ethodyldylidina, and the states with four unpaired electrons are named ethanetrail. Chemistry Molecular orbital theory shows that there are two sets of paired electrons in a degenerate pi bonding set of orbitals. This gives a bond order of two, meaning that there should exist a double bond between the two carbons in a C2 molecule. However, a recent paper by S. Shake has suggested that a quadruple bond exists in diatomic carbon, a conclusion that was opposed by J. Grunenberg. Bond dissociation energies of B2, C2, and N2 show increasing BDE, indicating single, double, and triple bonds, respectively. C2 is a component of carbon vapor. One paper estimates that carbon vapor is around 28% diatomic, but theoretically this depends on the temperature and pressure. Comets the light of fainter comets mainly originates from the emission of diatomic carbon. An example is C, 2014Q2, where there are several lines of C2 light, mostly in the visible spectrum, forming the swan bands. Properties The triplet state has a longer bond length than the singlet state. Reactions Diatomic carbon will react with acetone and acetaldehyde to produce acetylene by two different pathways. Triplet C2 molecules will react through an intermolecular pathway, which is shown to exhibit radical character. The intermediate for this pathway is the ethylene radical. Its abstraction is correlated with bond energies. Singlet C2 molecules will react through an intramolecular, non-radical pathway in which two hydrogen atoms will be taken away from one molecule. The intermediate for this pathway is singlet vinyl -idena. The singlet reaction can happen through a 1,1-D abstraction or a 1,2-D abstraction. This reaction is insensitive to isotope substitution. The different abstractions are possibly due to the spatial orientations of the collisions rather than the bond energies. Singlet C2 will also react with alkenes. Acetylene is a major product, however, it appears C2 will insert into carbon-hydrogen bonds. C2 is 2.5 times more likely to insert into a methyl group as into methylene groups. Charge density In certain forms of crystalline carbon, such as diamond and graphite, a saddle point or hump occurs at the bond site in the charge density. The triplet state of C2 does follow this trend. However, the singlet state of C2 acts more like silicon or germanium, that is, the charge density has a maximum at the bond site.